What is going on my guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Garrett with Game by the Beach and today we are looking to get over the cusp of what is it 5920 or something like that? Uh, which if you guys didn't know that's another legendary. I feel like we were just making this video three days ago, four days ago when we were at 4920. Picked up this deck and have since climbed, climbed, climbed and now we are right back at 6,000 trophies 100, 100 below 6,000 trophies and uh, and looking to push over to get another legendary and hopefully it'll be a legendary that I can actually use. I guess the only one left is Inquisitor but um, if you guys uh, if you guys watched that last video of me playing with the uh, pretzel thrower that game was hilarious and uh, and it was a lot of fun so here we go, we're starting off pretty strong here. We got a good amount of Boreas. We actually only have three Boreases. He's gonna spam out. Now we only have two, oh, but we can get a bunch if we want. So, so far so good. We've got John Portable. He's running, I've actually seen this deck a lot that he's running. The deck that I'm running is the most common like Boreas Shaman spam deck that you've seen on this channel a few times, but he's running the one with Vampire. I've seen it a few times I, I get the concept, put the vampire in there, you should have more mana to make switches and do different things like that. Um, I'm not totally sold on it, to be perfectly honest. Not totally sold on it, um, and, I've, and I've definitely beaten it plenty of times. It's probably beaten me, it's probably not super different, um, so it doesn't really matter all that much. But as long as we can make some switches, we should be okay. And, uh, and that was really good for us right there. So. We got Gorgon in 10 seconds. I haven't filled my board very well, but we've actually got a rank 3 and a couple of rank 2 Boreas's on our board, so I'm not worried. There's another rank 2, so we should be in just fine of shape uh, and be working towards that legendary no problem. So we're taking this guy out before he even freezes any of our guys. He did freeze them, but um, didn't really matter at all. So let us see what we can do. We got Warlock now in a minute 35. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that last video with the glitches. That was ridiculous, and uh, I'm sure you guys have ran into similar problems too. He's gonna spam me in two seconds. I can tell. Let's spam him first. If I spam him, it'll make him spam me. He's got three. Oh, ooh, I got it. Wow, that was like the slowest switch I've ever made, and it worked. Uh, I guess I'll go here. Um, it's a rank two, so I wouldn't switch it anyway. Another rank 3 right there. We're spamming him pretty good. Our board looks pretty decent. He does have a shaman he could he could spam. Uh, I'm just realizing now I'm saying spam a whole million times. If you guys saw one of the comments, <laughs> it was take a drink every time he spams. I'm not uh, I'm not telling you guys to, to drink alcohol, but that's pretty funny. Or maybe he was just like drinking water, drinking milk, just being a healthy guy. And, uh, and I made the assumption. So let's see, he's going to spam a shaman here. Ooh, that, again, that's helping us. That one didn't. Uh, but so far, so good. Let's get another rank 3 Boreas. I'm going to try and get mine to max as soon as I can. Um, but it's looking really good. It's looking really good. I think we're going to need two wins to to get the new Legendary. And I don't really know what I'm hoping for. I mean, if it's Inquisitor, I'll just throw him in my deck. And I'll and I'll have some gameplay of me playing the Inquisitor in, on this channel. But other than that... Ooh, I did make the switch. That was sweet. Um, but other than that, I don't really have one. Let's do another one. I'm getting better at these switches. I guess my Wi-Fi is working well today. Um, but so far, so good. He doesn't have any rank 3s currently. I should take this out before it takes anybody out. Damn, I just totally lied. I'm surprised that he, he it took it out so e uh, that I didn't take it out so easy. But this is the first game of the morning. He's taking it out pretty slow, but I think he's going to be able to... Uh, it's down below 100 now. Unless it goes up really quickly, it doesn't. So he's got a Shaman. He's not going to spam it during the banner. Cool. But at this point, we're already at max. He's at max too. Um, I guess the Vampire... Maybe the Vampire is better now. Like, I, I've, I've had the discussion with somebody to where... Summoner, because you're getting another player on your or unit on your map. It's similar to the Vampire. But Summoner is better in early game to where Vampire is better in late game. But we're going to see. Our board still looks way better than his. He's probably going to 
shoot some span uh shoot some summoners at me or some uh, shamans at me just like that oh let's do this actually let's do that that do a summoner now we've got a bunch of shamans everywhere Span that way. I'm just going to get another rank 3 on my board because I'd rather have some damage and then we'll keep combining out our rank 1 uh, Boreas's. But we've been in the driver's seat this entire game and we just haven't been able to put this guy away. So hopefully we can do that very soon because the longer the game goes, the scarier, scarier it gets. Let's do this. That was nice for us. He's hitting me with a good game. I'm, yeah, okay. That's and that's a GG. He's at 61. He's at 6100 with the with the vampire deck. So clearly it works. And uh, and yeah, we're at 40. We're at, oh, this is another thing I want to talk to you guys about. I am at 49% win rate now. And ooh, we actually got 35 cups. So this might actually be enough to get us to that legendary chest. So we'll open it up in just a second if if that's the case. But we're at a 49 win percent, which we've been at 47, 48 for so long. We're actually nearing 50% um, if we keep doing what we're doing. But victory chest, no, I don't want that. But there it is. Collect reward. You see it on the screen. Let's open it up. Here we go. Collect. Oh, right. This isn't the one. This isn't the one legendary. This is going to be a bunch of stuff. Cold mages. Love that. Hunter. Alchemist. <laughs> Priestess. Actually, the Priestess is a pretty cool card. I, I've wanted to try and find a way to put it in my deck because Priestess counters Shaman. Because if they come down and steal your units, it takes away a Priestess and it gives you, gives you mana. Here we go. Engineers. I feel like we always get Engineers right before we get a Legendary. Here it is. Legendary card coming up. And we got another Trapper. Guys, but now we can get our Trapper to level 2. So I think that would make all the difference. I think a, le a level 2 Trapper would make so much of a difference. I think it's now probably the best card in the game, if I had to guess, if I had to if I had to guess. But that is a legendary. We're only a few minutes in, so let's jump into another battle here. That was the first game of the day. It seemed pretty straightforward, pretty good. I'm gonna try and keep using this deck to push up further and further and further, see how far we can get. I got my sights on 7K, but that is uh, quite a ways away. Ryman, let's see if we can find a... Boreas, not yet, <laughs> haven't found a Boreas yet, he's got two engineers, I think we're in trouble, I could do my summoners, I want to wait until I can get one more so I can not use my rank 3, my rank 3, uh... oh my lord, <laughs> you guys are watching me brick, 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 and that's a good game, that's a GG right there, and that's what happens sometimes. This game, this this deck, you do brick, right? There's literally nothing else I could have done. I combined out everybody, and uh, and and that's what happens. So unfortunate, but let's uh, and and 34 trophies. You lose 34 trophies just like that. That's the only thing I hate. I don't mind bricking. I don't mind losing right away. Okay, I guess it's part of the game. But if I lose in the first like minute, like really, clearly something was wrong. <laughs> like you really have to take away trophies from me. But whatever. Uh, we do have shamans. We're running the, we're going against the Inquisitor deck. So this is the deck that probably gives me the most trouble. Unless I'm going up against a um, a mirror matchup with, you know, they they've got the exact same deck as me with Boreas and shaman and spam and everything like that. Other than that deck, I would say this Inquisitor deck gives me the most problems. He's running Cold Mage, Harley Quinn, Summoner, Mime, and Inquisitor, obviously. And uh, it's a really tough deck to beat. And you can kind of, I try to be systematic with my with my shaman spam, but uh, but it's kind of tough. It's kind of tough to do. I'm just gonna try and merge out all of my all of my uh, summoners there. We've got two Boreuses on the map, and I guess at this point let's just spam a little. Oh, we got him. But he's going to get another one right on his board. Might as well spam again. And uh, and now at least we have a rank 2 Boreas to hold on for a little while. But, I mean, that, that's kind of the idea. You spam a little bit, and then you get him out of out of his comfort zone. He should have the right amount. Oh, I tried to spam there, but he, uh, he merged out too quickly. Let's try and get another one. Nope. 
Okay, and now we're pretty set up. We've got two rank two Boreases. We're going up against the Gorgon in 20 seconds. We've been just basically a little bit of a pest um, in the beginning of this game, and hopefully we can uh, we can be okay. And he's yeah, he's already got three rank three um, Inquisitors, which is crazy because he doesn't even have Dryad in, in this deck. So so good for him. I feel like this is a much more chilled out video this morning. Which I really don't mind. I like just hanging out with you guys, chatting away, playing some games, getting some dubs. That's the way to do it. So he took his out way quicker than us. Our board's not perfectly set up yet. If we get a, another summoner, um, we can spam off a little bit with uh, with our Harley Quinns and our Mimes and everything like that. I love when I can get ha when I have a bunch of Har Harley Quinns, a bunch of Mimes, and then I get one summoner and I can just turn all the Harley Quinns into in the summoners, combine them out with mimes. It feels so good. It's really fun. There we go. And I'll show you exactly what I was talking about right here. So now you can combine them out with mimes, combine summoners, another one, get another mime, I mean another summoner, and there we go. And now our board looks a lot nicer. But let's start combining out rank twos, just because why not? And he spammed a little bit. We do have that rank four uh, shaman in the middle of our board. See, and right now, spamming shamans wouldn't really do much for me. I'm gonna try and wait until there's a boss or something, something like Gorgon, something like Bedlam, to where I can hit him a bunch of times in a row, throw him out of his out of his game, and then get switched a bunch of times or get frozen a bunch of times by the boss, you gotta work together. Because if I spam a couple of shamans right now, it's not really gonna do anything. It's not gonna throw him out of a, out of his game. It's not gonna mix him up at all. So there's not really a point. Let's keep combining out some stuff here. Let's do this. That was good for us. And I just don't think, I don't think the tamer is the answer. I might, I might pop off a little bit towards him just because I don't really have a better play at the moment. So let's actually do that. Okay, and now that kind of enabled us to make some more plays. I don't. E I have no clue what I just hit, but now we can kind of mix our board up a little bit more. We did out of that exchange. We got a rank three, at least one rank three, Boreas, and maybe a couple other things. But we still have sixteen hundred mana, so let's keep combining out our rank ones. Uh, we've only got one left. There we go, and let's do a summoner. I've told you before that I know like a number of different people play this deck differently. I really like to play this deck with basically, you know, combining out, merging out all my summoners, have as many summoners as I can all the time, and then, um, and then when I have shamans, spam them out. You know, people, people are more shaman forward thinking, and I think it gets them in trouble. But hey, we're playing against the Inquisitor deck. He has nine. We are going up against Tribunal in 30 seconds, so if we can make it there. We might be in pretty good shape. Let's combine out rank twos because I'm scared. Ooh, we do have a run. Okay, well now we have a shaman we can spam. And summoner. Let's do that. Let's do that. We have a let's do this and this. Just trying to dig for some better troops. Oh, I could have gone the other way actually. Uh didn't matter. Let's see what we can do. Okay. So we got five seconds. Our entire board is not rank one except for uh, one of our this guy who hopefully is not going to get taken away, but it's not going to matter. He did get taken away. He spammed his board. Let's hit him now. So this is this is the time to try and hit him, but I don't know if it's going to matter. And I don't have any shamans to spam, so it doesn't matter. But uh, we're probably in a bit of trouble right now. That was extremely good for us, but he got it right back. Please hit, please hit, please hit. Oh, man. We're in trouble, guys. Um, I guess I can hit him again just to see what we can do. Actually, I can do this. I was going to wait, um, and that's kind of why. I was going to wait for a rank 4 Boreas, but I couldn't find one right away, so I might as well just 
Hit him with a, a Shaman. Hopefully he can't find the right amount. It looks like he's already got it, though. Yeah. With Harley Quinn, it's so easy to get the right amount. Got another Shaman there. I probably should be being more patient right now, because I'm combining out too quickly. That's, that's, that's one of my biggest flaws in this game, too. But uh, when you're going up against the Inquisitor and he's got Cold Mage and he's got nine in a row, there's really nothing you can do. Unless you get Bedlam or something like that to where it it's completely switches up his board, you're not going to really change anything. So you can see I'm trying to pop off here, but it looks like this is going to be it. That's a hit. That's a hit. He's hit me with a good game. Yeah, you're probably right. We're holding on two seconds. We're alive, baby. We're alive. That's right. Let's do a shaman. Why not? Boop. Hit nothing. Get another uh, Boreas on the board. That would be hilarious if we can still stay alive, but it is tamer. Uh, I think we definitely didn't have good luck with the bosses that we got in this game. We got a bunch of tamers, a bunch of stuff that didn't do anything for us. We're trying to take this boss out. We're not going to be able to. We're going to take a hit in just a second, and that's going to be an L. That is an L. That, that deck is really, really tough. But right here, guys, these are the two top decks right now. I think Engineer's still really, really good. I beat Engineer most of the time. <clears throat> Inquisitor, this deck right here is the only deck I really lose to, like I said, other than the mirror matchup. But that is going to be the end of this YouTube video, guys. We got a legendary, and yes, it was the Trapper again. Just collect some of this random stuff to make it a chest opening, right? But that's going to be the end of this YouTube video, guys. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will check you guys out in tomorrow's video.